You have identified network throughput of the port terminal on your M1 that small EC2 instance when uploading data into Amazon S3 in the same region. How do you remedy this situation? A. Add, add an additional EMI or SIG network interface. B. Change to a larger instance. C. Use zero connect between EC2 and this S3. D. Use EBS PIOPS provisioned IOPS on the local volume. Call transfer is B. Change to larger instance. Change to larger instance to take advantage of EMI, enhanced network uh, adapter, which provide higher network, network throughput. Instance types and network performance. The M1 that small instance type has limited network performance compared to the larger instance types. Upgrading to a larger instance type can provide better network throughput and performance. Improved network performance. Larger EC2 instance type come with higher network performance capabilities, which can help alleviate bottlenecks when uploading a large amount of data to S3. Next question. When attached to Amazon VPC, which two components provide connectivity external networks? Here's two. A. Elastic IP address, EAP. B. Not gateway. C. Internet gateway. D. Virtual gateway. You should be careful. Attach it to Amazon VPC. Internet gateway and virtual private gateway. Only these two can be attached to VPC. Not not gateway and not. EIP Internet Gateway An Internet Gateway is used to allow communication between instances in, in a VPC and the Internet. It provides target for routing, routing down traffic from your VPC to allow instances with, with public IP addresses to communicate with the outside world. To enable instances in a public subnet you to access to Internet, you need to touch an internet gateway to your VPC and configure appropriate road tables and security groups. Virtual private gateway. A virtual private gateway is used to enable communication between your VPC and external network, such as on-premises data centers through VPN connection. It provides a secure encrypted tunnel for network traffic between your VPC and external networks. A virtual private gateway are used in conjunction with VPN connection to install your on-premises network to the AWS cloud, allowing secure communication between your internal network and Amazon resources. Next question. You have an auto-scaling group associated with ERB, and you have noticed that inst inst instances launched with the auto-scaling group are being marked unhealthy due to ELB health check, but these instances are not being terminated. What you need to do to ensure trial instances market unhealthy but ELB will be terminated and replaced? A. Change the threshold set on after scaling group to health check. B. Add a reciprocal balancing health check to your IG group. C. Increase the value of health check intervals set on elastic load balancer. D. Change the health check on set elastic load balancer to use TCP label than HTTP checks. Exp explanation. Call transfer is B. Add elastic load balancing health check to your after scaling group. Health checks. By default, after scaling group perform their own health check on instances. However, you need to configure after scaling group to, you, to also use ERB health check to determine the health status of instances. This ensures that ERB mark when instance unhealthy. The after scaling group will take action to terminate it. In the after scaling group settings, you can specify the health checks type in the ERB, which allow after scaling group to integrate with ERB health check and manage instances based on health status reported by the load balancer.
EOB Health Check allow us to determine if our application which is hosted on EC2 instance healthy or not healthy because if you have problem with application for example we have EC2 and on that EC2 works our Docker container. If Docker container have problem maybe ISG can, can, couldn't identify that. ISG only can identify uh, the or uh, the virtual, uh, virtual machine level problems, for example, problem which is related to EC2, but not related to containers, uh, which provide us our application. So, in contrast, that the ELB could check the status of containers because in ELB health check we specify port, and other that port works some service, some services. So that's why you need to integrate your behavior check with AMA after scaling group. Thank you.